What is up guys, JCD here back with another video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to tame an Akatana in Ark Survival and yeah let's just get straight to it so to tame um to tame an Akatana all you will need is sweet um vegetable cake that is the only thing they will eat for you to tame them so to um I'm gonna show you guys real quick how to um how to make some so you will need a cooking pot you will need um two carrots you will need two long grass you will need two save roots you will need four stimulant um, 25 fiber a water skin you will need two um, giant bee honey and four tree sap so let me just get the water real quick and you will need something to turn on the cooking pot of course so let's get some water Oh my gosh. Wait, I'm confused. Does it have water or not? Ah, uh, what the fuck? Uh, alright, so I got my water. Light that thing on, put the water in here, and in about like 20 seconds, um, you will get sweet vegetable cake. So the um, the Akatana they spawned in the swamps. That's basically where they at. It's a the swamp is a very dangerous place, but yeah, that's the the only place where they spawn. Oh my gosh. I'm so retarded. Alright, so let's check the map real quick. And this is where I am currently at. There's other swamp locations. But every time I want to tame when I cut in, I just come here. And um yeah. So make sure to head over here. Um, alright, so is this done? I keep putting out the fire, man. Unbelievable. There's only one saver root and one long grass in there. Oh my gosh. I'm selling, dude. And there we go sweet vegetable cake now all you have to do is look for your uh, katana and since the swamp is uh, you know very dangerous make sure to bring um, like four um, walls or something or doorways I mean door frame so you can you know protect your katana from these predators so I like looking for them over here where I can actually see I don't like going inside the swamp because I feel like it's just harder so yeah just look for them around here I don't mm, I don't think they spawn a lot over here but you can find them. Let me see. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see. 
Well, let's let's go back. Oh, wait, I think that's one right there. Is it dead? No, I killed it. No, bro, you're trolling. I think I might just have to go in the swamp now that I killed that one I haven't really seen much spawn here I mean, it's gonna be easier for me since I'm in creative. If you guys go in here survival, it's gonna be tough. Oh, I found one. Uh oh. Alright, so level 20. Now, let me build around it. Let me So I'm gonna shoot it in the head And there we go It is unconscious Oh Fuck off Did it kill it? It freaking killed it bro Oh that is so annoying That is such a nuisance Oh my what is that? Oh, okay. Well, time to look again. Alright, guys, I am back. And, dude, I spent like 20 minutes looking for this thing. That I just had to, sp to spawn it in. I, I had to, man. So, yeah, it took me so long so I mean if you can find one I guess just move to another like another swamp but yeah I had to spawn one in it was just taking way too long for me to find one so what you want to do is um, get it unconscious depends on the level it will go like inside its shell and it will take longer to tame but I would just build around wait, wait. oh I think I need a foundation for this mm -hmm. all right uh, you can also use these spike thingies yes the um, wooden spike walls you can also use these these are these are also good to protect I mean you can also protect it yourself just by killing things around it and making sure there's there's nothing dangerous you don't really need this to be honest but if you want to be as safe as possible then you can just do this you probably need one, two, three, like four. All right, so while it's unconscious, you want to put the sweet vegetable cake in here and just wait for it to tame. It does have a um, low turbo health, so you will need narcotics if you want to keep it unconscious or just shoot it. <laughs> And by the end of this video, I will show you guys what the uh, Akatana is good for. But for now, let's just wait until it's tamed. And there we go. Now it is tamed. And I will show you guys what this tame is 
good for it. Let me just um, use a cryopod and get it out of here, bro. All right, so for the Akatana to basically be useful, you want to put sweet vegetable cake in it. It's the only thing it eats, man. Literally. So while it has food, it will make um cementing paste you have to go to behavior and enable wandering now when it starts moving it will start making um cementing paste in its inventory you can just you can make like a little um you know like a little what's the name of it a little penthouse for it to stay and just walk around like a 2x2 two two or something and just wait for it to make a cementing paste well I'm gonna do that right now actually um, I'm gonna get some sea look And there we go. It has a cutina paste, which is literally the same thing as cementing paste. Um, where you want to craft something, you can use a cutina paste. Uh, and yeah, this is this is probably the best way to get um, a cutina paste. You can just get a bunch of them, and you know, you have a farm of cementing paste because cementing paste is. Um, an annoying resource to get and yeah that's it for this um, for this guide if you guys en enjoyed please leave a like and if you like my um, content if you like arc please subscribe so you don't miss uh, a future arc video and yeah I'll see you guys next video